So this is a patient card, RFID enabled card, uh, that can be used to, uh, to authenticate the customer, the patient, and also be able to walk them through the entire customer journey. So I'm gonna use in the RFID authentication, it will also be used with a QR code. So, uh, and then there is a RFID reader right here. Now it recognizes me, it does basically the database lookup and pulls out my record. So currently this part is registered for a different patient. So there are three options. You can see the thermometer, blood pressure, and blood glucose. So for thermometer, I'm gonna use the thermometer option. So, so here, uh, this is my last measurement. I'm After switching the start. on device power, please press next step. So this is the device. They're all connected to this robot via Bluetooth. And I'm gonna take the temperature. Start. Upload successful, your temperature is 36.1 degrees Celsius. So my temperature, it recorded my temperature and actually uploaded it as well. And do the blood pressure check as well. So similar way, it, the blood pressure can be actually self-monitored. I can wrap this thing around my arm. And administer my, uh, my blood pressure. Last thing that I'm gonna talk about is, I'm not gonna demonstrate that, uh, it is the, the insulin level diabetes. Uh, so this is the uh, device that connects to that. This is the syringe to take the blood samples. Uh, and these are the strips that actually does that, and this is the device that you can actually inject the insulin as well. So this is basically, in a nutshell, uh, a lot of these peripherals are actually, they can be custom designed with the, with the use of 3D printing, um, and this also has a modular approach to it that has a 3D uh, UV light that can actually, essentially can be harmful for human beings, but it can be uh, automated to uh, drive around in a self-automated uh, uh, they're finding the capabilities during the night time and whatnot. Uh, uh, use case for a B2B market for uh, telcos where telcos can actually collaborate with healthcare industries uh, and having a unique uh, use cases, uh, especially in light of the COVID, where the social distancing is maintained and uh, a lot of self service uh, is enabled by the use of patients themselves where they feel comfortable. The, the first line defense uh, uh, care nurses and the doctors also feel comfortable, so they're not exposed to the, the, the patients with, who are infected with any kind of, not only COVID-19, but any other viruses. So that's, that's about it for this, it's called TEMI. And, uh,